Hello and welcome back to another episode of XCOM 2 War of the Chosen. My name is Saiken and today we're continuing the flawless run where I'm trying to beat the game as good as I can. Hopefully zero death, uh, zero lost missions and uh, hopefully not even taking damage. Let's see if that's achievable. We are at Operation Righteous Stroke. I'm trying to uh, maneuver us through the next retaliation mission and we're at a point where the enemy's hit points build up more and more which is why I'm taking classes where we already have upgraded weapons so at least try to put in enough of them. We're getting uh, very soon our predator armor upgrade which will be great because that gives us way way more utility items and then on top of it uh, we will upgrade all of the other weapons potentially even all the way up to plasma so we're going to rush that so far things are going in our favor we have brought our usual team uh, and i tend to bring ripper with us as well only because uh, the bulb up is upgraded and the bulb up had a plus one damage uh, breakthrough so he tends to have a power spike at the moment and we might uh, want to use it for our favor of course, I would prefer playing with the Templar, but that guy is currently on a covert action mission. Five hostile forces are attacking the outpost. Eliminate all enemy units and protect those civilians. Advent came in hot, and so did we. You won't have a concealed position for deployment on this one. Good. Straight up, thirteen. Uh, mm, thirteen. My life is in your hands. Civilians that we need to save. Uh, let's position ourselves here. Yeah, I got the berserkers now. I can't do much from range, but they're lethal up close. That should not be a big problem. Uh, that, on the other hand, would be a problem. Carefully moving to positions Copy where we're not being spotted out. This should not spot them. And we do have a sniper position for next turn. Well, now we're being spotted out. Inappropriate Murphy has broken his concealment. In the meantime, on the other side of the map, Berserkers are starting to hammer us. One Berserker is down there, gotta deal with them in a second, but for starters, let's remove the stun answer. Open up. You know, I could remove his cover, or could at least deal three points of damage if I miss, which isn't bad either. Berserker could go through here. Move up. Hit and kill this guy. Can we land somewhere in the second floor? We know the Berserker is down there, right? Right, okay. So. I move. Let's wait until the berserker comes up should not have the range to actually reach us all right keep hitting it good job well done everybody and now he's standing there like a wet towel 
doesn't really know what to do. I can tell you what to do. Do this and let's read it. Your raging will not help you. It can be mad all day long. I could seriously not care less. Reload, shoot, down. Good. One berserker less. Fantastic. I go where I'm needed. We're going to do what's needed, which is increasing regional income. I'm on the move. Very good. Understood. Moving out. Good. And in the meantime, we're I'll moving move. into cover, reloading where necessary, and we're just going to get uh, six it. civilians so that the time pressure is out of these missions. <sighs> Central. Really, what is going on? Did you wake up and decide to not put on your big boy pants? a difficult pack might as well do a little bit of this out of curiosity now nah, can't reach them but that's okay because they will not know where it was coming from of course they will run to our direction but I, they should not be able to spot us out This guy down. Very nice hit. Enemy destroyed. My ammo's running low. Move up. Got some death from above. Ready to serve that to you. Oh yeah, and some implacable. I like it. Continuing to enrage this guy. I like it. And that's another berserk down. Right there. Reload after death from above. Moving up to close the rings and overwatching. Good. We're losing civilians left and right, Commander. We 
We need to get these people out of here. I will go. All right, I think we successfully discovered the first faceless one. Well, hello there, beauty. And a pack. Let's try to get the advent back. That was good. Good, we're reloading and we're going to set up the faceless one for a nice kill. Oh, minimum damage, that's so unfortunate. Okay. There's a good chance that we kill it. Nope, apparently there is not. We're continuing to move up. Nemico neutralizzato. Mi farebbero comodo delle munizioni. So you got one more enemy to go. And we're just going to pull back a tiny bit. Overwatch. That's the last pack. We're losing civilians left and right, Commander. We need to get these people out of here. Volk says I am to obey. Clear this area. Almost there. This should almost trigger. Yeah. Ricevuto. Mi muovo sull'obiettivo. Good to go. One, two, reload. Um, to go. Three. Ignore the loot there. Four. Reload. Di nuovo in partita. Alright, that's the last patrol. And this here is an explosive, isn't it? Hmm. Okay, that's a sizable pack. I would like us to take the high ground, of course. Full cover over there. That's a bit too far. Squad side uh, penalty will kick in. So we're going to take high ground with with grappling up next turn and we're just going to reload here overwatch cool 
Closer than I could remote start you guys. Unfortunately, I can't. Moving to designated position. Moves up. It's just going to set them up for death from above. pushes him all the way to here. Two, four, six, seven, new. No, not dead enough yet. Because you can always deal minimum damage, and that unfortunately will prevent you from killing them. I go where you tell me. Oh no, oh, the preview was. Incorrect. Damn it. Good, we can still try to shut this guy down. And we haven't been clustering up, so that's fine. Plus there are civilians around. a successful shutdown. Oh, hair trigger. Oh, that is convenient. And that's a kill. Moving out of the way because I don't want to have to do anything with uh, that purifier. Double move, interesting choice. Sometimes a double move becomes a double explosion, as they say. Absolutely. I will go. We're taking maximum distance. Mainly because I don't want uh, the faceless one to run up to us and uh, hit us.
complete surprise that he jumps off uh, onto the roof. finish status confirmed we're not picking up any additional contacts the AO is clear status confirmed mission accomplished good very good that wasn't even close I think we saved 10 L 11 civilians Zero in is good. Um, Wrath isn't bad either, in case you ever need to reposition. But I will start with zero in. Oh well, uh, just six civilians. Really? Was that bad? You and your crew have dealt another serious hmm. blow to okay. the aliens' efforts today, Commander. Impressive work. Good more bond improvements which means all of the bonded characters are at level two then already great more potential supplies there let me ask you something two more days until resistance comes okay let's speed that up by a day so that we can go further and get south america because we need more resistance contacts now Fabulous. Currently, we don't need another um, another resistance uh, contact, but it's good to know that we could get another one. We can't establish any new contacts until we upgrade. Good. We got mental fortitude. Greater resolve. Oh, that's not bad either. Pursue of knowledge is okay. Voluntary uh, volunteering army is okay as well. We don't know the European bonus yet. Mm, I'm just going to follow where the next um, where the next facilities are, and two of them are literally over there. So we might we might want to go for Russia or Asia rather. Supply drop is coming in fast. That'll be 500 in our current state. Let's just get some more intel in the meantime. Got an urgent communication coming in for you now, Commander. It is unfortunate, Commander, that your recent efforts have proven to be so. Cool. Um, faceless ones. Yeah, that, that's not too bad. None of uh, them really is bad. We get more resistance contacts. I like that. Rewards are doubled isn't bad either. Two additional turns is good. That'll make our missions way easier. We could immediately get two resistance contacts and that will free up an engineer for now. Not bad. Let's do that. Avenger plotting new course. As I mentioned, I wanted to Our actions have succeeded. really quickly expand. If you would order us, Commander, we will cool. So, promotion uh, wouldn't be bad. But. This here wouldn't be bad either. It's 
Someone gets plus three aim. I think a good target of that could be a grenadier. Good, that goes down to 13 days, which isn't too bad. I mean, we're getting more and more hints of her facility. And taking her out actually would make our life substantially more easy because we would get Arashi and the Katanas and no more, no more her popping up on any of the missions. Two Sergeant Grenadiers, that is a tempting offer. Engineer plus Intel, and all we need to fight is Losts. Hmm, Commander, that indeed is a tempting offer. Us down every day. The only way we can stop them is to strike first, and we'll need to work on a covert action with the Resistance in order to do that. Good. Or you'll get one battle scanner. I mentioned that. Upgrade the pistol. We should be good. It's been slow going, but I've made headway interfacing our equipment with the alien technology still embedded throughout the ship. Most of the primary systems. Yeah, we'll keep the other supplies. An additional engineer would help us to clear the machinery even faster. Uh, once this machinery here is cleared, we can go for proving grounds that will also allow us to get all of the alien ruler weapons, which isn't too bad. And in the meantime, before we're, f I would love to finish that, but we can finish it right afterwards. Eastern United States. Command, you should be aware. We're detecting lost activity in this area. Our forces will need to be especially vigilant. Good. So we got a lot of tired uh, folks. Might be a good mission for the B team, you know. Enders um, can chill for a bit. And we're just going to take the B team for a spin. We get a lot of Grenadiers soon, so might as well go in uh, with uh, the characters that currently have the power, which are the Rangers, just leveling up a couple of them. Rangers tend to of course be great in endgame, but they also are okay in the earlier parts of the game. Um, if they do have a strong weapon, really all they need is run and gun from time to time and uh, the ability to yeah, run next to an enemy and shoot them in their ugly face. Good, so that easily works. Um, I'll just put the battle scanners on you, just in case we're working against the Chosen. Flashbang, again, just in case. Maybe a little bit low on the explosive side. Let's pick one more frag grenade. That's three explosives, although we're fighting against the loss, so explosions should be our main thing. Very good. Sky Ranger deployed. Squad green to deploy. All right, so we landed. Let's take a look. This is our VIP. We got one, we got two, and an exit zone. Gotta be a bit careful here. We're fighting not only the loss, but we're also fighting Advent on top of it, which is 
a problem. On up gates. Will do. If possible, I would like to let uh, both side fight each other, and we're just going to be the beneficiary. My followers specialize in wielding psionic energy, mastering the power that belongs to all who are truly of this earth. Good. But we don't know what we're up against. Could be anything. Uh, mm, the force level has increased. So mutants we have already seen. Codices could be there. Spectres could be there. Not yet advanced mechs, but we're getting close. Definitely improved captains. of losts interesting this here should not break our concealment Menace one five you've got the primary targets in tow secure any additional operatives if possible but make sure you get our contacts to the evac point got you so we're taking definitely taking this and uh, this balcony Let's split up nicely. Go, go, go. They found us. What, where? How? What? So someone with an all-seeing eye? How did that move to here? trigger them when the Templar has moved through them beforehand. That makes no sense. Okay, let's try to get a bit of focus for the Templar. That clearly didn't work. The Templars ebbs and flows with the tide of combat. As we focus our energy, our power increases and can be unleashed upon our enemies. Good, that's a hundred percent kill. Taken care of. Not sure if moving out would be advisable. I think the answer is no. Let's just be careful for now. That one triggering, I don't know how it happened. Ready to engage. But we lost concealment over it. It's not the end of the world. It means one less surprise attack. On the other hand, enemies could run into our overwatch trap, so I guess it's a fair trade-off. Wow, good hit. Lovely. There's another pack over here. over there I mean right there so can't just move in without triggering them they are three tiles away from the edge of line of sight so we need to get onto the balcony that'll keep the loss set bay and we will have an ultra safe position there but that's a strong pack over there shield bearer good let's see if this triggers oh, 
Hopefully it does not. Hit and kill the Viper. <coughs> Fabulous. Good hit. Vince here. Enemy destroyed. And that's not bad for rookies. Well, not exactly rookies, but squaddies. I would love to go in with a Templar, but we know of that additional pack. And we can't let uh, that happen. That's a hundred percent kill, even if we miss. Might as well reload. Always keep your ammo count high when you can. And finish the sector. Superior stock is great. I like it. Tebla moves up. With Overwatch, the shot would have been uh, worse, as in less chances to hit. Like the lost are getting a lot closer to our position, Commander. Prepare for more incoming. Good, more losts. Or in this case, unfortunately, not so good. Because they are, of course, as always, targeting us. 66% chance or 70% chance to uh, target XCOM and a whooping 30% chance to target someone else. Starting with that. Kill confirmed. I'm ready. Gonna need to reload soon. Hostile neutralized. Reload it. My ammo's running low. Been shown on Tavix. All right, Vince finally moves out. the brute. Lots more losts left and right. Okay, we just need to get rid of all of the losts <coughs> and then we can slowly advance. I don't want to pull this pack, specifically not with so many losts. Those with an extended magazine, no, actually wins because you do have the pistol that deals three points of damage. George is going to go to town. Da 
luckily we upgraded the pistol <coughs> which is three to four points of damage is fantastic kills a lot of losses at this point oh. unfortunate Good. Big time clean up here. Let's do this. Rain and ammo fast. Losses only give half of an experience point, but you can see if you kill enough of them, you get a promotion just like Sam did. This should not trigger because we're having an equal distance to the pack. And there we go, we're upping our We're upping our focus. Good. I think we dealt with the losts. If we're lucky, that other uh, pack of Advent uh, will also move into us. But they potentially will not. Good, Lyrical got a promotion as well. Let's slowly but surely put this team down here. There might be a pack right here. And if that's the case, I would like us to be full force. And you know what? Given that we do have battle scanners, might as well use them. Okay, called it. That was a sector and something else. That something else had a lot of hit points. Could be a specter. But it's atypical that they are coming that early in the game. In either case, full reload, overwatch, and next turn we can move in. Spectre. Mm. Beautiful. Just what we needed, right? And another sectant. What would appear to be a single entity is actually a swarm of tiny robotic units working in close coordination to maintain a cohesive form. Almost. Now we can one shot them. We're definitely going for parry. Heading there now. I shouldn't have said that. 
Um, this here makes for a very convincing case. are coming closer but shouldn't be here yet. Crit could have solved that whole specter thing. Let's hope the Spectre is just going to uh, try to go for a takeover, which it is. We can kill it next turn. Shadow bind into mind spin, and we should be fine. Yeah, unlucky with the Spectre, we could have easily killed him. turn and that on the other hand will not end our resistance contacts had heard rumors advent might be rolling out a heavy infantry armor system looks pretty tough well at least the swarm will likely take the heat off of us hmm. okay so Panic removed, which is great. Target neutralized. Getting that dasher down. Now we're not taking anything short of a hundred percent. just does not fully kill him. Oh, that is so unfortunate. Just get all of the dashers. Target neutralized. Position bestätigt. Erledigt. Good. That gets us back <coughs> into the game. single kill well it's not as yeah, it's not an immediate kill unfortunately Order's confirmed. 
but he's taken out for one round which means in return this guy is 100% dead um, need to look at our ammo count not 100% dead he's taken out so hmm. hesitant to uh, to shoot onto someone who's stunned Getting that Viper would be a great option. Two, four, six, not a hundred percent kill. That Viper would be good. We need to get that other grenadier next turn. Enemy eliminated. Cover my flag. Training ammo fast. Good. That's a shield. Interestingly enough, he shields our units as well. And that Overwatch will go straight into the lost. Okay. Very good. And that shield is solidly removed. Even better. Affirmative, moving out. That's one of the contacts we were looking for, but there are still others in the area. Nailed him. Good. Let's rock. Getting that guy down. And we're just uh, we're just clearing the battlefield here. Let's go for the trooper. Good shot. Fantastic shot. Not quite there yet. Nope, not even the dasher. Confirmed. 50-50. That is not good. Bring an ammo fast. Affirmative, moving out. I leave that other lost right there for him to deal with. Destroyed some loot. Happens. And we're moving up. Okay, cool. Shield bearer should go for the lost. Well, or not. Maybe just blatantly ignores him. 
which is a real shame. I'm careful with not triggering too much additional stuff. Let's get that shield bearer. Cool. It hit the plate. Gonna need a reload soon. Lost gone. Another lost <coughs> down. And kill that guy. Good, getting some high ground. Ready to go. Okay. We're going to get some high ground there very soon as well. Hayward, Overwatches, and let's get our VIP slowly in position. We have a very, very solid position here. Now, there might be another pack of Advent. We killed one, two, Three. Yeah, there's potentially a fourth pack. Good, we'll do the good old um, Templar Auto Pistol Escapade. There you go. Good. That's a kill. should soon be history. If possible, I'm not hearing anything. There are no additional VIPs or resistance operatives working in that area. You should be clear to move for extraction. Okay, that's what we want to hear. Running. Roger that. Easier than expected. I thought we would be okay, they don't have in for another pack.
Okay, sorry. Got slightly distracted here. Good. The only thing that would happen now is that a couple of lost swarms would be coming in from time to time. But that should not deter us. We are ready and on our end on our way out. So. getting a little bit more XP don't think that it'll be it'll be enough for her to level up but yeah might as well take that free XP with us sonar same thing well that didn't work out and therefore, we're out of here. Good. Easy peasy. The losses themselves are not the problem. And uh, if you use the balconies well, then they should never really be a problem. The Spectre uh, pack was a bit more iffy, but we almost managed to take that down in one go and lots of promotions here good fabulous almost everybody got uh, promoted to corporal Matter of fact, everybody got promoted to uh, Corporal and even a few Sergeants, which is great. Two Grenadiers on top of it. Which now gives us a really, really solid roster. A bit heavy on the Grenadier side. Because I think we have like seven or eight of them. But then again, if a mission gives you th uh, two grenadiers, uh, mm, there is only so much you can do uh, in terms of an even roster. Two, four, yeah, six grenadiers, four rangers, a couple of charge shooters, a couple of uh, specialists. It's not my typical roster. I typically tend to go more for specialists, but since we're uh, not playing a challenge run, and I, since I want to uh, play as clean as possible, we don't need that much healing. But if you're struggling, you should always go for healing. It is the single uh, strongest and easiest way of uh, beating a higher difficulty. Avenger plotting new course. Good. Back to 200 intel. We can definitely expand. Cool. And with that, uh, we could go either here or straight into Africa and then uh, take it from there. Let's do the African route. resistance we just established contact with have sent over all the intel they've collected on the chosen operating in this region so, yep cool come to strike at me i eagerly await your arrival commander so 
So we still need to get more intel. We're okay for now. But there is always room for more intel. Proving ground needs more power. Fair enough. Which means that's the point where one of our uh, soldiers, uh, engineers will continuously help with the proving uh, with the power relay. Might as well speed this up to be honest because there are a lot of things that we can build in the proving ground. Yeah, and we're continuing to clear up the rest. Almost done with plated armor. And almost will be forced to move into this facility there. Let's just double check something real quick. Commander, the aliens continue to make progress on the Avatar project. If we're going to slow them down, we'll need to move fast. Um four more days until no more tired Templar and then I would just do the um, I would just do the um, facility here even if the doom clock is not full because once you're doing could you shut up central now that we've established contact with the local resistance We've got the details we need to move on the alien's facility. This is our chance to set back wow. their avatar. He is there. unbelievably annoying. So what I was about to explain before Central rudely interrupted uh, was even if you're not uh, fully uh, filled with the avatar project, there is a, a good theoretical reason for doing uh, the uh, facilities because once you do the facility, there is a six week uh, grace period where no more progress on the avatar project is being made and that in return will greatly greatly help you commander we've utilized all of our available communications capacity we can't establish any new contacts until we upgrade our system so you essentially keep it low the entire time integrated warfare is great i think we're going to go for that next uh just need more intel really and as I'm saying that, we do have to protect the device. Um, for a hundred into, that's a convincing case. Uh, we're getting another sharpshooter. That's not a bad one up as well. Another higher level sharpshooter starting at a sergeant is not too bad. You know, I'll think about it until the next episode. Uh, for now, we're done. Thank you for watching and have a great evening. If you enjoy the run, feel free to leave a like uh, and a comment down below. That would mean a lot to me and see you in the next episode. Bye bye.